hey guys what's up thank you for tuning in and as you i'm pretty sure you clicked the title because you want to know more about spoon flower well i'm also interested in too i'm a freelance artist and i've been um designing for quite some time but i never created a spoon flower so today i thought might as well let's create a website on spoon flower and see what are the income and if it actually if you could actually make some money off of this website so let's go into the website what does this oh, right here and i already had it like it's already in google so this is the first page spoon flower fabric official website so yeah make sure don't get confused so when you open the website for the first time this is the first page by the way i am not sponsored by them or anything like that i wish but i am not i just want to make some extra income you know like everybody else you get what i'm trying to say so yeah let's see so this is their front page and i l already love you know some of these artists um work because it really uh, I could really connect with them because for some of my designs, like a lot of my designs, this is my art style. Not completely, but this is the, some of the type of art styles, um, patterns I, I usually make. I love kids' work, so this is pretty good. Uh, vote, haunted study wallpaper, enter pattern clash. So I, I heard that every week they have this pattern... Um, like a uh, what you call it I'm not sure if it's every week or every month they have this contest where you there's a challenge and um, you know if you win they put your artwork in their front of the page like their home page no five dollar was swatch required okay yeah so basically you know this is really good to enter especially have your art out there and see what are you you know what are you doing wrong and these challenges will actually help like create the design like for the next month like you can always see like what design should you create so you can enter these design because you know that's what's trending right now so you always want to make trending designs trending patterns you know to stay on top so this is the menu so we got fabrics by category, animals, nature. So, you know, I'm usually more, my art are animal and flowers. So, yeah, I have like all different type of animals. Nature, definitely. I do a lot of botanical. I do floral. I do have some fruits. Um, yeah, so by color. So make sure on the title, you are being very specific on what are you, what is your uh, design at, for that, you know. Basically, on the title, make sure to write detail so you stand out. Uh, so here's some beddings, you know, uh, let's look at that, do it covers. Yeah, that's pretty nice. And this is where I want to be selling my stuff, uh, my design to be on. And it actually gives a little thing. So, so the main purpose of this video is to sell, right? So we are going to join, right? Let's go click on the join right here on the top. And my name, same screen name. Uh, what should I put? Farida Art. S T U D I O. This should be right. Who's gonna take this? Okay, I don't believe this thing. I don't believe it. I'm gonna keep going going. If it doesn't work, then oh well. That's my email address right there. Let's because I want to know what is trending by clicking here. You identify yours. Sign up. Let's see if it goes. Because it keeps saying the store. Okay, the name is not taken. So why don't I make all that? I want to save this thing because I keep forgetting my thing. Okay, shop all do it covers. What is it? Upload a design. So what we're gonna do is upload a design. We gotta log in, right? We just created that. I don't know why is it not login. Bus. Oh, what is that? Is not a bus. Buses. Buses. Oh, 
Okay, so now in order to start designing, you need to upload a design first. Okay, select your files, right? And this is everything that we have to do. I'm gonna go ahead, patterns. These are all my designs for my thing. So I'm gonna start off with, mm, I'll just do this one, right? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do one file at a time. My internet is very slow, so you know. Uh, I already uploaded. Okay, five minutes. So, um, so far all the research I did, you have to um try to get at like, you know, ten fifteen, uploaded and print them. I mean, um, purchase them, add to cart, um, like fifteen twenty of them or ten fifteen. How many ever designs you got? and then um, purchase them at once. So in order to start selling on Spoonflower, you have to purchase the fabric. That's how it works. I don't know why, but you have to have the fabric in your hand in order to start selling. So that's their rule. Um, I don't think there's that much money. I actually didn't check yet. We're gonna check together, but definitely let's see. Okay, so this is the editing thing. Uh, wow, it's that big, huh? Let's see. Uh, let's make it a little smaller because it's too big. No, I like it like this. Um, smaller? No, a little bigger. Choose fabric size. Cotton. Coffin. Okay, I'll do this. Uh, oh, we're gonna need a bigger. Yeah, like that. So it's up to you. What do you wanna do? Text with flat quarter. I'm not even sure. Eight by two. Um, I think they could do yard. Save. Gonna name this mm. fall. Well, what is this? Fall leaves. Fall leaves. Gonna need a fall leaves. Uh, yellow. Green. Description is the maximum is 150. Mm, say color. So I'm gonna put. So basically, um, the descriptions, Spoon Flower already gives it. So you're fine. But it's colorful. Leave. Design. Why? Any fabric? I don't know. I'm, I'm I suck at um, giving descriptions. I'm just not the description type person. So let's lay for some tags. So I'm gonna put leaves. There's eight left. So uh, mostly these can't really help. Uh, okay, for now I'm just gonna go with that. Thumbnail, I'm gonna put that as a thumbnail. I would like to include this design. So in order to start selling, you have to purchase it, you see? To start selling, proof and sell. Basically, that's what it is. You have to purchase this. Um, that's what it is, let's see. Uh, I wanna put it in a So now post. Let's see what happens. Okay, um, that's there. That's done. Okay, so you have one right here. Post your three. 
this to do 23 and one, two, okay. And now we want to upload another design, right? We want to have a couple of them. Maybe we could do a couple of, let's do, okay, so I am finally done. We have this, uh, this is all my designs. I made it public. Make sure you put it to public, add a title and add to a collection. So if you add to a collection, it's gonna, um, you're gonna save some money and some like, you're gonna save a lot of money basically, because if you add to cart one at a time, they are about $5 each and you know, that's a lot of money. And I have about, let's see, where is my designs here? I have about how many designs? Let's see, I have about 24 designs. So that's why, um, what we're gonna do is, right? This is all my designs. I hope you guys like them. So basically, instead of paying $5 per design, what you're gonna do is come to this page right here, fall, fill a yard, and basically you're gonna put into a grid, right? Into like a blanket or, it basically it gives you different options. These are the three options, but you'll see in a little bit, it will, you know, basically you arrange each of those design and you put it into this little square thing. So that's what we're gonna do. There's so many different types of ways you could fill in your Blanket or I don't know quilt. Is that what you call it? Look see this is how it turns out Very cute uh, or you could change it into a, like a scrunchie like there's so many different ways to really Create this so what we're gonna do is create a collection I'm gonna hit that and I already have my own collection. So I'm gonna click on that and These are all my design for this collection. I put it all into one together and we're gonna start designing this right so now, this is how it is. And so now from here, here's the thing where uh, the fun part starts. These are all the different types of way you could add your design to. So you can be so much cheaper and so much more better. I found this uh, on a YouTuber. She really explains it. Um, if I could find her, I'll put it down. But yeah, um, basically it's so much cheaper, half the price as purchasing them by one by one i have 24 design imagine that 24 times 5 hell no i'm not paying that much money especially if i didn't even purchase anything so let's go ahead and choose uh, since i have 24 designs it's not gonna fit any of them so some of the uh, two designs two four this is 48 two yard this is 12 so i could have 12 um two yard and I can have, basically I could put this in this design. It will be, so I'll, I only have to buy two of them and it will perfect, um, be really good. You know, um, basically I only have to buy it two times and all my designs will fit in two quilts basically. So let's design this. My daughter's sick, you can hear her in the background. But yeah, these are all my designs. So what you're going to have to do is, right, these are all my designs that popped up. And now all I have to do is take it one by one, right? Click on the design, click on this, click it, and there you go. The design pops up, right? So I'm going to put it in a nicely order what I think will look best, right? We'll match it, put it on that one. And we're just going to fill in the box, right? We're playing, this is like a puzzle right here. will be really nice. Uh, let's put this one here. You know, make it all pretty. That one there. That one there. We're just filling in the gap right now to make it look all cute. Uh okay, so this comes out to $58 each. Wow, that is crazy. That's a lot of money. Finally done. And this has been over two hours. I really thought I was going to be done before this. But unfortunately not, because I am in a big dilemma, because the fact that, look, if, this, so that, uh, this option with 12 design was $58, but then this option, when you pick this option with 48 design, look how the design turns out. Like, this design right here, 
if you can see where is it um it, it doesn't really show the whole the whole design because i guess my uh, files are bigger so that's why it cuts off a lot of the design and not really understanding the pattern here so i chose to go ahead with the 12 design and the design looks so much better it fits the whole box and i am willing to uh, purchase more uh, i'm willing to purchase getting more expensive because um due to marketing strategy so i need it for something else so that's why i'm going to be purchasing um you know um you get what i'm trying to say so i'm going to be purchasing these two 12 by uh the 12 set 56 by times 72 yard cotton satin fabric but if you have a lower budget i think in the future i would definitely do this um but for now i'm going to be doing the bigger squares because that's what i need i'm gonna go ahead and click check out Okay, so I put in my information. I didn't want to show that, so I cut that part off. <coughs> so you're going to do it. So I'm going to do the standard ship, and it takes about seven to nine days for $6. So let's go ahead and click that. Finish. And the orders are in. Everything is good. The I'm just waiting for my order to come in. Oh, wow, this finally is showing there. The designs but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section down below and i'll definitely make the uh, second video to this because i don't have my fabric yet when my fabric come in i'll definitely show that and see the quality and definitely just see overall until then of course i'll be making more designs because i really want to see how i'm going to give it all my best and give give it like a good three months just focusing on this and making patterns and trying to make a business out of this and um make sure to follow along see if it actually worked because i'm gonna put in all the work and maybe you could do it too so yeah let's check it out if you can actually make a full-time income from spoon flower so until next time i'll see you next week oh, hopefully the fabric come in or a with a different video so let's see so by now, don't forget to please subscribe and comment down below what other type of videos you want me to make next. Because I am thinking about uh, also joining other platforms like like this, like on-demand platforms. So yeah, if you guys are interested in that, I will definitely make a video on that too. So see you in my next video. Bye!